Oh, I haven't done this in a long time. Uh, usually, I'm in the, when I'm in the Southern Africa. Uh, well, I keep uh, like memo books and and I, you know, I make notes or whatever have you, uh, because I've been here. Well, hey, this is a book that I got. What's my journal that I bought when I first got here? Nice journal. I got that. Got the blue cover, of course. Got the little strappy there, and then you got this thing in the back here. And that's just what, what, uh, what I'm supposed to do. But um, uh, so I came. I came and uh, I made my own little calendar in there. I came whatever in, in, in no March, March, February. Got here February, beginning of March, and then I I made this calendar the beginning of uh, May or the end of April. Uh, because things were winding down, I decided to make a calendar, calendar the book, and uh, so this is uh, my 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 healing uh, thing. When it got to uh, May, that's what it was. When I got to May, it was like every other day, so I noted that, and then uh, I, I leave July July third. That's my life day, so I leave then. I love traveling on my life day. Usually, I'm, I'm, I'm my life day and on uh, New Year's Eve. Those are the two days of the year, and that I try not to be around normal circumstances, let's put it that way. And especially my life day, I love, my life day, I'm usually out of the United States because you know, the July 4th is the birthday of the United States and you know, blah, 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 whatever. And especially from in the South, that's really strange because they shoot guns, ah, I'm not into that. Anyway, so I'm usually traveling. So this day, I actually begin, well yeah, the early morning, July 3rd, like two in the morning, something like that, so I'm traveling all day. By the time I get to Cape Town, it'll still be whatever, you know, like that. So I'll be there, then I'll be there, I'll be, uh, I'll run immediately to, uh, I'll only be one day in Cape Town, I got to do some stuff there real quick, uh, check on some stuff, but then I go immediately to my wife in Gubevu, that was a village like there, um, get to Gubevu, um, and then I'm in Dumbaza for this whole week here, and hopefully I'll be in Gubevu another weekend, and then uh, somewhere in here I got to leave for Cape Town because here I have food dialogues for these weeks here from the 22nd of July until the 4th of August. Uh, I got food dialogues. It's a very important initiative. Um, oh, don't worry about it. Look, I'm going to go tell you. When we get closer, I'll tell you about that. Um, and then, then, then I don't know what, see, what I'm trying, I think what I'm trying to do is, is get my wife to come down to, uh, to Cape Town. Then, so for, in here someplace, maybe we'll go to, uh, to uh, Musenberg, because I like the vacation, when I say vacation, over right there. And so maybe we'll spend that thing there, because then I got to get to the States. So I figured I'd be to the States. I get to the States. I got to really get there early enough to do, so I got some stuff to do. So hopefully I get to the States somewhere in here, at the very latest, depending on what happened, uh, beginning of, this is uh, uh, August, so around here, at the very latest around here. Then I'll be in the States from here, all the way until November, the elections, then sometime right after the elections, then I'll leave back for Cape Town, and I'll be there maybe for just a few days, and then I'll be, uh, I used to pull that, and then I go to the Eastern Cape, and I go back to my, my humble abode and where I do my operations. <laughs> so we'll find out about that later. So that's the, oh, all the time I make a book, I always make a book that has the uh, numerology thing. So this is a numerology chart. Um, and you know the numbers go from one to nine. They do the Lord straight on way. Then you, the, the letters go uh, A B C D E F G. A, like nine is high. J K da 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 da. Actually, my initials are A J S. So I'm all ones in that. Anyway, so I, I usually have this chart here uh, when I want to work things out with people's names and stuff like that. Then here I have my chart for the prosecution uh, way of things. You know when the development raise is of. Four stages of development, your physical stage, your mental stage, sexual stage, and your spiritual stage. Those energy points, I don't want to get into it. Anyway, so these are the ages of that, you know. So right now, I'm in my, oh, I'm in my spiritual, my second go-round of the spiritual uh, energies like that. That will last to, uh, to 91, or 91, I'm sorry, 81. And then you'll be back into my physical thing, uh, and then to 90, then it goes like that. See, I plan to live to be like 150, so I, actually 151 to be exactly, but you know, but uh, somewhere in there. So I, I plan that's one, two, three, the fourth fierce spiritual phase, then I'll, then I'll, uh, uh, you know, ascend someplace. So like that. Uh, what else? Is, let me just keep on going to the back here. This is the back of the book. Well, if you want to call it the back of the book, go ahead there. Oh, nothing back there. Oh yeah, oh, 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 oh. 
Uh, and now, now every time I, uh, uh, different phase of my life, I have different, what do you call that, uh, I call them tours. When I first really started traveling, well, when I first started traveling out of, well, for an extended period of time, my first tour starting in, uh, was, was that, uh, 20, uh, 20, uh, 2003. It was the uh, Unsequestered Monk Tour, and that was a successful tour. That lasted for quite a while. And then I got to, yeah, then, then, then just, uh, it just, I just started this next tour here. Uh, that, well, actually, there was something else in between. Well, the Unsequestered Monk Tour sort of like, you know, some say fizzled out, but it sort of changed. But I didn't name another tour. But now I'm on this, this tour right here. I'm announcing, I'm announcing the, uh, the Demise of the Colonizer Tour. That's what tour I'm on right now, and that'll last for a long time because it's going to take a long time. I mean, not take that long to to uh, to get rid of the colonizer, and that starts circa uh, 2024. So I just named this tour this year, the Miser Colonizer Tour. Oh, I was, I, when I travel, I always travel. Well, I keep this thing. This is um, in the back here. It can really they had a pocket here, so I have a copy of my passport, just a copy. It doesn't mean well, just in case I need. It. Like they say, instance, I don't carry my passport with me when I'm going around, but I always carry this book with me. So if something should happen, whatever have you, at least there'll be something that uh, people can reference to or something like that. Not that anything's going to happen. And then, uh, you know, when people say they pray, uh, well, I won't get into it right now. Let me just say, I have a, um, a way of praying. I give thanks and praises, right? And I say, I thank love. So instead of, <sighs> this whole long, I'll spend some other time. But thank love, plays, uh, praise the Lofi. Um, and then I say, it's sometimes very, well, sometimes I say, Ja Rastafari. So my three phrases are, thank love, uh, praise the Lofi, uh, Ja Rastafari. Uh, now, since, well, I got, yeah, be grateful for Shiva uh, embodying uh, the eye of me. That's just a, a, a thing that I put here because I'm in India now. I'm sort of keep that as, it's like an asterisk. Well, it's not even an asterisk. It's a side because I do plan to come back to India on a regular, you know, let's put it that way. So I'm, I'm into, well, I'm into M2. So I'll explain this some other time, right? So what else do we have in here? So we keep on going in the book. Now I make, I, I, I do the journal. Oh, what's this here? Oh, this is the song. When I finally get healed, I'm going to put it upside down. And I'm going to sing this song when I finally get here, because I'm on my Healy tour right now. I made a little song. Uh, let's see what else is in this book here. Oh, this is uh, what the hammock's going to cost. I'm bringing back a couple of hammocks. Uh, so when the double hammock is 2,050 rupees, the single ham hammock is 1,550 rupees. This, will, this one here, of course, uh, this one exists in Gubevu, and this one exists in Dembaza. I was gonna buy something uh, for um, for for the states, uh, uh, but I'm, I'm not gonna do it because I don't want to carry this stuff like that. So like that, I'm getting something else as a present for somebody. Uh, oh, this is when I did root song uh, for Africa Day. I uh, I transposed root, root song, and so uh, it's, it's like four pages. Of, I had to do my poem. I had to. Had to do my poem, Root Song. Um, sort of like a theme poem of mine. Well, it's my, well it's, it's, it's what, it is what it is. And this got translated to, to Tamil. So I'm gonna have, well, I'll tell you that some other time. So let's see. I'm going from the back, I guess, here. Oh, let me go back. Let me go back from the back, upside down from the back. Uh, let's see what else do we have in this book. Going from the back. I'll get to whatever I need to get to. Meanwhile, so here's a blank page. Oh, here we go. So I write in a journal. Almost every day, just a little something, maybe a paragraph, two paragraphs. The last thing I wrote was here. Oh, down. The last thing I wrote last night I was at uh, my spot where I eat at night. Uh, downloading some good music will be all day. Will be da oh, downloading a lot of uh, of uh, 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 while I'm here because the data here in India is so cheap. So uh, before I leave, I'll be downloading a lot of stuff. So I'll, I'll have it on my phone. So this is all the stuff that I've been, now I just write on one side of the page, and this is in green pink. So what's going to happen? I'll get back to that around in a second. When I, f when I finish this side, I'm going to keep with this journal. I'll, I'll take it to the States. But then when I come to the end, what I'll do is I'll, I'll turn it over, and I'll start writing like this and go, go like that. 
which is why, let me go to um, here, and I'm writing in green on that, which is why, now when I come here, some pages you see that I'll have, it'll be, see, it'll be, well, that's brown because it's something else like there. Uh, I had to write something. But see, it's brown. I have brown ink, and those, those are sort of random notes, the brown ink or black ink. So this is, oh, this is the uh, uh, consalva I wrote for, uh, for uh, concerning Gaza. Did that the week before, or no, a couple of weeks before I did the uh, Africa Day at Artis Cafe. And then uh, uh, this one I was working on here, so I had some false starts or something like that, or whatever I was doing. Then uh, a couple of weeks ago, I did, uh, because we're in Oroville, and it's whole thing with the mother. Anyway, I did a, uh, a cassava for Oroville, right? And then just this last uh, uh, Saturday, it's every Saturday, the open mic, I did a uh, cassava called The Mighty Ones for, for children. So, because, of, uh, anyway, so I did that one. So the one I'm working on now, I won't, uh, I just sort of bled through, so I'm gonna put, probably put it on this page. In fact, let me show you what I'm working on. Then, well, anyway, so, so you see all that green is that thing. Then I take notes on this other side. I get back to the Quinsaba and, and now let me do it now while I'm here. So I'm working on one right now. And I had this whole thing. This is the, this is the, I'm writing a, a dialogue. This is my, I'm writing this long dialogue. And in fact, I like it so much, I'm gonna keep on going. I got another, another one of these books. And a dialogue is basically, is what it is, a dialogue. It's a dialogue uh, with myself. Uh, and I'll explain that some other time. But all he's done, it's got uh, basically, let's say 13 uh, alliterations, 13 selves of me, 13 uh, configure 13 something of me, right? Now it's 13 because Anthony is, is the main guy, so it's actually, think of it as, uh, uh, you know, Anthony and, and the 12 apostles, or aspects of, of, of Anthony, there's aspects, that's what, what I want to say, aspects. Um, so I ran out of brown ink, so I'm, tr I'm trying to find a brown pen right now. But um, so I'm, I've been writing now since I got now what's the page, whatever. So I, uh, I I write these things and then I I send them to. I well, they supposed to have two other writers, but they then flaked out on me uh, to see what I'm doing. So they should be writing along with me. But of course, you know, people claim that they're writers, but. Unless you're consistent every day, yeah, you're not going to do it. Now, I figured it out that I now until we finish here, uh, if I do four pages a, a, a day, I'll end up there. But I do, I do one, actually, I'm, I do one to, to, to four pages a day. Last time I did four pages. But I really like to do two at a time. So that's going to be like that. But here's one I want to tell you about the cassava. So because, in other words, this, this will end on page... I don't think I have it numbered. Do I have it numbered? No, I don't have. Yeah, on page 90, 99, we'll end this 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 book. Uh, page ninety nine. So I have these other pages here. I want to say for scrap for, for for other stuff. So I'm working on cassava right now. Cassava. When I work, it's it's, it's a poem. It's a, it's a forty nine. It's a forty nine word poem with uh, uh, no word being more than seven letters and um, basically seven lines. Uh, the, 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 the um, how you say that? The exception to that is that you have a proper noun, like a name or something like that, a place, then you can use more than seven letters. So I've been working on one, you see how I, I work, and I'll post this on my thing. So uh, this one is gonna be, uh, basically this is the word, uh, uh, Bratz is, is the real, the real, the, the, the autochthous name for India. And so I say, come back India. And it's like holding on this African theme like that. And, and then I, 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 all of the Indian neighbors are, are in this poem. So I'll, I'll, I'll read it. I'll, I'll just the first draft. I got to do another draft. But I'm waiting for my brown pen because I'll do the other draft in this book here, which will join the other, you know, the other things. Um, but uh, this is what I want to get to. But when I say Africa, I don't actually, I'm not, well, I am talking about the landmass, but I'm not. So... Africa is not a land uh, uh, mass, but a but a concept in humanity is what I wrote the, the note I wrote back there, and I'll expand on that some other some other time. So anyway, so this is 
So I'm writing, this is my dialogues I'm writing. I write the journal, then I'm writing the poems. Some, I, I, this a, I don't know, when people say they have writer's block, I don't really understand what that means. <laughs> I don't get writer's block. I'll figure out something that I'll be writing. Okay, so, so that, that next poem that I'm doing, uh, uh, that next concept will go here, and then what will happen is I have, that will go there, and then I have, while I'm here, and this is the whole thing, so all these conservatives too are being, when I do it, I do it as open mouth live, and they, they do a translation, like that. usually this guy, so it's do, he was nearly, so, so this, uh, uh, this girl did it, I say girl because she did, well, she's a young, young lady, and, uh, and so we might just stay with her, but anyway, um, so th this one that's, that I'm finishing now is going to be presented on the 15th, this coming Saturday, and then that means I have two more uh, before, before I leave. I sort of know what this one's going to be. I don't know what this is going to be. I just wait, you know, whatever inspiration comes like that. But now what I'm thinking is that uh, because it gets translated to the, to the Tamil, what I'm thinking when I get here, um, uh, somewhere in here, maybe I won't be on a Saturday, but something like in, in here, what I'll have, um, uh, I'll take a break here. Somehow I'll have translation with other people Maybe it will still be a Saturday. I don't know. Uh, uh, with other people. Uh, so if we're in a, in a closer country. Actually, my wife speaks uh, Afrikaans. So I might do one here because uh, I'll be with her on the weekend and have, I'll have her do the Afrikaans translation like that. Then, uh, then uh, we'll figure something out. Um, then uh, I got Muscoli for the for the closer translation. Anyway, um, somehow I'll figure something out until I get to the States where I don't, uh, I might stop the Quinsabas when I get to the States until I get back because I like these translation things uh, because I'm, I'm gonna, I'm, uh, I've thought about this. I want to make a whole thing where I, um, where I basically uh, will have the, the, Kosava, right, then the trans, like it'll be the Tamil translation there, next to it'll be like a closer translation of whatever which I'm working on, then when I get, like, like it'll be like like a, the Afrikaans translation will be there, so I'll make an exhibit where the uh, the English, or my my Kosava will be there, and then wherever I am, there'll be a translation uh, uh, of it next to it, right, and that'll be an art exhibit, right, and also, those, these things are small enough that when I'm, I've had this idea for a long time, I tried to tell some poets to do this. And of course, ain't nobody listened to me. But one of the things uh, in, in South Africa, well, in uh, the Eastern Cape where I am right now, uh, they have a theater. We, we just built a theater complex, I'm told. I'll go and see what's happening. And that part of that will have an art, an art uh, thing, so that will be part of that. But as, uh, you know, when you have an art gallery, you should have the prints or whatever, have it like that. But I want to have... Uh, a whole thing where you have like a like a skirt, like a fabric, one of those wrap skirts. You know what I mean? Like you know, like a like a wrap skirt, right? And I'll have Kosava's will be uh, the the words, the poem will be on that. So so as we as the exhibit is up there, then you can get uh, the poem or that exhibit with the Tamil and the whatever the translations on a skirt, right? And that means that you can take that even put it up on your wall. You know, so you have the poem on your wall as a skirt, or you can just wear it. You see, hey, don't worry about it. I, I, I don't, I don't tell people this a lot, but I, I'm actually uh, really good at marketing. I just don't market. I don't like mark. I mean, I'm not a capitalist marketer. Okay, see what else I have in my book in this book here? Go oh, notes. So I take notes along the way, and I put the notes on the others on, uh, on, uh, on this. You know, on. Why is it that side? No, that's something else. I put the notes on the other side, and usually I send another pen, you know? So the, the, this is green for the, for the journal stuff. But then I'll have, um, what's this here? Then I have notes on this side. Like this is our stuff for um, uh, for blood pressure and muscle health and all the rest of that stuff. Uh, I'm very interested in and herbs and stuff like that. Uh, this is, oh yeah, this is the whole blood pressure, uh, essential minerals and whatever it is. 
I got. I'm, I'm taking some tests when I get back. I'll see if it's cheaper there, like that. Um, usually, it's doing this. I usually don't have. What is this? Dennis, da, 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 author. Oh, a uh, William Patterson, civil rights. That that's a. That was a. Paul Robeson's partner, one that they had, did that. He wrote the Mask of Justice. That's what I wrote there. I want to check that out. Um, uh, let me see right here. Oh, see, I don't even know why I got it in green here. A biography of Jeffrey, somebody like that. I make book notes. Uh, military Industrial Congressional Complex. I, I make these notes in this thing, but usually it's in another, not the pen I'm writing in. Uh, it's on this side, it's, it's usually a note. So if it's like this, it'll be a note. If it's the other way, when I, well, we know when it's a journal entry. Okay, here we go. There's another page. So, oh, I have a, I have a fraternity meeting, a Zoom fraternity meeting. One's coming. Oh, Thursday. What's, what's today? Today, Wednesday? Yeah, so tomorrow night, well, it'll be Friday, Friday morning, uh, that time, because they're, they're nine and a half hours behind me. So about 3.30 in the morning, whatever it is, I have to be up for a, a, a fraternity meeting. And uh, I made some notes because there's three things I got to suggest to them, so I made some notes for that. Uh, let's see. Oh, and uh, oh, here's that's the. Oh, that's just my budget. Uh, how much money I'm spending. Uh, and then I make some notes like a. Uh, oh, say like wild rice. I got to get uh, what stuff I got to get. The vitamins, things like that. Then the magnesium. I got that already. Then I made some other notes what I had had to buy here, but that was in the same thing when I first got here. Uh, so that's it. Uh, see all these kind of just I make notes. Usually, the like I said, the notes is in another color. But right now, I made the notes on this side of the page. That means because on this side of the page, so the missing shoe. Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, this is still even though it's in uh, this when I first started, I used the black, uh, black writing, the black pen because I didn't have a green pen. Oh, that means I must have bought the green pen here. I gotta go and get another green pen. Okay, so anyways, that's when the, the, the dogs took my, well, there is, the notes like that. Uh, brother woke up at 4, then uh, Friday, March, see, so March 22nd, so when I first made my first day, finished school meeting. Okay, uh, oh, okay, here's what I wanted to show you. Um, so when I start a book, I got a, you know, you're supposed to, it's my wife's phone number, uh, I usually, you see here, but uh, it's my title, title, not a title page, but it's like an identifying page here. It says, The Brother, Anthony John Sloan, was made in the Patterson Projects of the Mont Haven section of the South Bronx of New York City in the wilderness of North America, right? The Brother is of a lineage going from, uh, like all humans, Africa onwards. The brother identifies as an American African. I noticed now, now some, a lot of people are starting to use that American African now. So use, look out for that. People are going to start. The African American is not a, a well, you know. You know, I love black people because you watch. We're going to start saying American African, and then everybody's got to adjust. <laughs> it's going to be funny. Uh, uh, the brother identifies as American African, made in the aforementioned South Bronx of New York of New York in the middle of the year, in the middle of last century. Okay? That would be, well, the last century. But here's the interesting thing. I think, did I put it in there? So that's how this uh, book goes. Then I, I told you about that. Okay, that's how this book goes. And then here, I think I put something in the, what do I do here? Oh, I explain it here. Wait a second. Oh. Oh, I know. So I'm putting the notes here. So I gotta. I probably have it upside down. Just so I'm finishing this book. I, have, I already bought another one. Another one of these. So I'm gonna keep on writing these dialogues. Uh, I'm gonna go to the states and I still write the dialogues. I enjoy it. Like you know, every night, every day, somewhere in the day, I wrote two, two whatever pages. Oh, here we go. Uh, of these long pages, the dialogues are very interesting to me. Uh, it's like I'm a playwright. I'm, a, I'm a audio dramatist, you know. So I have to continue the dialogue. Just here. Okay. So my pr when I pray, um, 
I, I'm of the Bob Marley School, or the Rasta School of give thanks and praises, right? This whole thing, petitioning, you know, uh, begging God or whatever, and, and you're so, oh, please, I need this, or whatever, nah, nah. It's like, if you really believe in, in the higher power, whatever have you, then believe me, the higher power, or whoever created you, know what you're doing, know what's going on. So they don't need you to remind them or to petition them, right? I, I actually got that from a, a, a Roberta Flax one way back in the day, uh, where somebody wrote a song goes, God cannot be petitioned. Anyway, it doesn't matter. So that's always in, in my mind. So what you're supposed to do is give thanks and praises. So instead of saying God, and his, because, anyway, I, I replaced the word God with love because you, uh, uh, this is owing to my, uh, uh, I say, Christian upbringing because I was a Catholic, Catholic, grew up in a Catholic church when I grew up when I left at 17, maybe sooner than that. You know, priest came to me and I said, ah, I'm through with this thing. Anyway, uh, but there's, there's this whole thing, God is love, you see. That's why when I play that Prince song, um, Love That Will Be Done, you just replace it with God That Will Be Done. If you listen, if you listen to a song as God that will be done, then you you know what you know what the boy is singing. Anyway, uh, so for me, God is love, so that means love is God. You see, so I, instead of saying God or whatever else people want to say, Allah, whatever, uh, you know, who, uh, Yahweh, whatever, whatever name they've given, they've given the Creator, which is kind of stupid, because that means you, if you name something, that means you have sway over it. So how can I have sway? Now nah, I won't get into it right now. Anyway, so I say, uh, thank love, meaning the whole thing that I came out of, right? Then I say, praise Alofi. Uh, now Alofi, because I have a, um, because of, 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 of uh, theater, I have a, 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 an understanding of, uh, of Yoruba culture. And because I had, I've had so many uh, dealings with the Yoruba culture, including in Brazil with, uh, with uh, Condon Blay, um, you know, in North America with, with uh, Santeria and uh, anyway, the Yoruba culture. So I identify most of Yoruba culture. Now, if I had my druthers, I'd rather be with the, I shouldn't say it this way, but I, I, I'd like to study the Akan. I would rather have, I'd rather have come up with the Akan culture, you know, become an Akan priest, and I don't want to get into all this stuff. Uh, but I like the Yoruba culture, plus I like their stories. Can you know, did a lot of, uh, with, with theater and whatever have you. So the, the, the Yoruba stories make a whole lot more sense to me than, than the biblical stories, you know. So I'm not, a, I'm not a biblican like most people, even though I do have my Gullah Bible. Anyway, that's, leave me that alone. But I really, of uh, course, to me, the Yoruba stories, they make more sense and they cover everything. Anyway, so, so I say praise Alofi, identify with the Yoruba culture. So I say thank, love, praise Alofi. So it's like both of them is God. And then when I want to, I say, Ja Rastafari. That's the, uh, the newest uh, culture, whatever have you. But I like the Rastafari because here's, here's the thing. Do you realize that, that uh, at least I know, back in the day, the <laughs> reggae music was the only one that said, kill the Pope. I'm sorry. I just had to throw that in there. So any, anyway, it doesn't matter. But, so I, and, 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 and if you really look at it, if you go any place on the planet, there's there's two cultures, to me. There's only there's two cultures that are every, that are, have a presence every place on the planet. That's the Chinese culture, and the Rastas. Rastas are every place you can go. Every, wherever you go on the planet, you can find yourself a Rasta. So, uh, and uh, plus I have, have this whole thing with the oh man, with the, um, my I don't want to get into it. But it's a whole thing, so I'm I'm close to that. Um, um, then I have these these uh, these sayings that I, I'm I'm starting to put. I'm starting to write out for the stuff that I'm doing in uh, in Dimbaza with my group, my group of young people, uh, or people, I should say, because I deal with the whole community, uh, including. I uh, can't wait to get back to the wisdoms. That's my uh, that's my seniors, my uh, my Dimbaza Society for the Age. Those are my favorite people. I have most fun with them. So I have, we have these things called township tested. I have this thing called location specific, which they don't know about yet. And I got uh, a lot of commission. So, a lot of commission is like um, God commissioned, right? This is only the only closer people would know what I'm talking about here. Then I have something from my grandma. My grandmother always used to say, "Ignore the ignorant." So basically, it's you know, all the stuff that's happening in the world. People get wrapped up in that. It's so weird and going like, you know, it's ignorant. So why are you going to keep on addressing it? That means that they got you. They got you interacting with the ignorant. Think about it. That makes you 
ignorant. I don't get it. And so, so I exist in the third infinity. So uh, the third infinity is what that is. Um, but that's another time to worry about that. And then here's another. Here now I got to get to this. And this will end it. So remember, I'm an American African made in the South Bronx in New York City. Now how this goes is the, the first thing, the American part, is the geographical location or the, 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 the no, 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 I'm sorry, say it another way. It's the passport I carry. So I have an American passport. So um, I, that's it, I have an American passport. Now if I gave that passport up for something else, um, let's say, a, I don't know, a Rwandan passport, then I would be, Roma, I would be a Rwandan African. You see what I'm saying? Or, or a Nigerian African, or whatever it is. Or if I went to Australia, I'd, give it, I'd be an Australian African. It's, you see, it dep- this has to do with not what I identify as African. Okay, that's, that's, the, that's the through line. That's my autochthonous uh, 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 through uh, lineage. My, my autochthony leads me to Africa. Okay? So my uh, nationality, if you will, if you want to put it that way, is whatever my passport says. So that so that's, has to be it has to be what it, it's first. So I'm, I'm an American African, right? Cre- then where was I created on the planet? I was created in the South Bronx of New York City. So I'm an American African made in the you know in the Mount Haven section of the South Bronx of New York City, right? Now the African African here. Now, the Afri- people, people think, they say it's the continent, what have you. I don't think of it like that. Because even America, it's a concept. It's not a... Uh, how is it? The, I got this from Mr. Neely Fuller Jr., let's put it that way. Uh, there's no such thing as America. It's a concept. It's a concept that you can either make work or not work. So to me, African or Africa is a concept. It's not a landmass. Yeah, what do we, it's named after this guy. Now nah, forget all that stuff. Right, not forget all that stuff. Don't, don't leave it alone. But it's a concept. Now, how I come to that concept, my, con- my understanding of African is defined by, and I have to use the African for the by Mangalisa Robert Sabuque. Because when I was at Fort Hare, what I, 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 went into, I found one of his writings, you know, um, one of his, his uh, scholastic writings, you know, his, his academic writings. And at the very end, he has his initials. It says M-R-S. So for me, he's mangly so Robert Sabuka. But one of the things that was said in this writing, or maybe I didn't get it from there, it did come from him, to be African means that you have humanity. You see? So to me, the African concept is, is, is a human concept. If you have humanity, then you're African. And since everybody comes from humanity, comes from Africa, that means that basically we all need to to, to, to be truly African, or to to, or to acknowledge, or to uh, pay homage, or to respect your lineage, your ancestors, you know, your autochthony, right? Then you have to have humanity, and only way you can have you 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 identify humanity by by this concept of African. So. You can say you're African, but unless you, you're doing humane things, then you're really not African. You can live on, in, on, a, on, a, on a, the landmass called Africa, but unless you're doing, you're being humane, then you ain't African. And I insist, if I had my druthers, <laughs> my thing is to be on the continent of Africa, that landmass, then if you're not being humane, if you're doing all kinds of, I don't know, colonizing things, whatever, then get off. You can do the colonization. There's a lot of other places on the planet. You can do your colonization or whatever it is. It's not for Africa. Simple as that. And again, you can be on another place, like you can be in India, and still be African. It just means that you're doing, you're being humane. You're, do, you're being humane. You're being African. Because we all have it, you you can be in I don't want to say Scandinavia. You can be in one of the Scandinavian countries, and to be humane, tapping into your 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 lineage, your autochthony, tapping into that, which goes back to Africa. And as long as you're being humane, then you can you can be a Norwegian African, made in whatever whatever Norwegian country uh, city you you're born in. You see, same thing for any any place. You know, you can be. Chinese African made in um, was uh, Beijing, whatever the, the thing is, right? You can be Laotian African made in Long Pavon. 
You see how that, that goes? So, but, but, but if you're going to accept your, your middle designation as African, which means that you have to accept humanity to be humane, to, I guess, to be a Christian word, word, to treat others as you want to be treated. In other words, you, if you don't want to kill, then don't kill. <laughs> if you don't want to be killed, then don't kill. That's it. You know? <laughs> if you don't want to do, if you don't want to, you don't want wrong to be done to you, don't do wrong. That's, that's the whole African concept. So, I, I, like I said, I went through my, uh, my notes here. I do this every, I don't know, usually once a year, once or twice, twice a year I do this. So, I did it now. Uh, so, that's what I did. Okay. So, I got to go. I guess I should turn this around and say bye to you properly. I don't know how to, I can't find a. I can never find this thing where it is. Oh, okay, well, whatever. Oh, I'll just turn the whole thing around. Okay. Hey, it's been me, T, from the Pattersons, taking the train to Tibet, letting you know what I've been doing. All right? Talk to, I mean, writing, that is. Check you later. <laughs>